The octopus blends into its surroundings to escape from predators. But it also changes color according to its mood. Blue if it's excited, pale if it feels fear, and red if it's angry. When it mates, the male inseminates the female by introducing one of its tentacles into her. When the copulation finalizes, the female will try to devour the male because it won't eat again until the young are born months later. Usually, the female dies because of weakness shortly after the appearance of the eggs. With each laying, the female has to watch over about 150,000 eggs. The octopus is a nocturnal animal. During the day, it hides among the rocks. If it doesn't find shelter, it builds it by piling up rocks on the bottom. It's also common to see one sheltered among the coral and trying to block the entrance. The octopus is a voracious hunter. Thanks to its unsuspected intelligence, it ambushes its prey, pushing them into a corner of the coral and surprising them at night while they sleep. But octopi, in turn, are the favorite prey of moray. The flexibility of the octopus is amazing. It can introduce its tentacles into the smallest niches of coral in search of food. The octopus's most rigid organ is its eye. Whatever its eye can pass through, literally, all of its body can pass through. One of the keys to the survival of the species is its adaptation to its habitat. The octopus is almost perfect in that. Its ability to mimic, elasticity, its ink to frighten off predators. But its most formidable adaptation is its intelligence. It can identify colors and forms, and not only associate those colors and forms with meaning, but remember them for years. <laughs>